Hello, it's Judita from Bye Bye Stress. I want to talk about depression and anxiety today. It's a big topic, right? But many people are now getting out of anxiety, depression and are able to manage stress. And you can be one of them too. What's the trick? To be open, to try new things. I know that it, it might seem like, oh, it's been so long, I don't think I can get out of it. I tried everything. Don't give up. Try this tool. It's a tool from Access Consciousness and it's called, Who Does This Belong To? So, you know, when when we are around negative people and we tap into their world and then you feel like you are pulled down by their negativity. That's what I'm talking about. We are so aware of other people's thoughts, feelings and emotions that we make them ours. We will just let them affect us too much. What's the tool? So you ask for any feeling, thoughts, emotion that is bugging you. Just look, look at it and ask, who does this belong to? And I say, return to sender with consciousness attached. What if it was so easy? Just return to sender with consciousness attached and you can send away any feeling really. Just try it with curiosity. What if it works? Your life could change totally. Right? For me, it worked just two days ago. I was feeling quite depressed. No, it was maybe three days ago. I had many clients and I didn't take uh, time for myself. So then I asked, at the end of the day, I was feeling depressed. And I asked, who does this belong to? And I felt straight away a lightness and I just said okay return to sender with consciousness attached and I, I felt it lifting it's not mine when we say with consciousness attached it means that the person is not gonna feel bad again you're not making feel him feel bad or, or uh, depressed again He's gonna be aware of it and and recognize that he has a choice also to return to sender or to uh, choose something to change it. It's not our nature to feel bad, depressed. Our nature is nature is pure joy. So everything that is stopping you from having it, you can send it back. Return to sender with consciousness attached. It can be so easy. I tell you another time when I was really depressed. It's not funny, but I was in India uh, and for five years I was depressed from 27 years old. And uh, we were at my yoga teacher training and I was um, with my group and teachers with, at the beautiful, beautiful um, waterfall swimming in the waterfall the elephant ha elephants have just left and we could now swim and then my teacher asked me why are you so sad and really that was the first time i acknowledged that i am sad and why am i so sad what's making me sad oh that i haven't got a boyfriend really i thought is that why am I sad? I could have a boyfriend, but I just didn't find the right one. So I was sad for not having one. For years. How many years did I waste without this tool? Five. And how many young people and how many even older people are sad because they haven't got a partner? What if you are just aware of that emotion and Maybe it's not even true for you. Now I am not sad even if I am alone or if I am with a partner. If I had that tool, it could save me a lot of sadness in my life. So try it with curiosity. Curiosity. Don't judge it. Just try. It might work for you too. Have fun. I hope to meet you one day. Bye.